reminds me of the example of Dr. Morris Bukail. Many of you may be aware that Dr. Morris Bukail was a very famous surgeon and scientist who was given the French Academy Award in Medicine. And Dr. Morris Bukail, he was selected for doing research on the mummy of Manapta, that is, the mummy of the body of Pharaoh, who was there at the time of Moses, peace be upon him, which is mentioned in the Bible. And after he did research on this mummy of Manapta, which was found in the Valley of Kings, he being a Christian, he was aware of the background mention of Moses, peace be upon him, in the Bible. And he was aware that the Pharaoh at the time of Moses, peace be upon him, when he followed Moses, peace be upon him, when he parted the sea, and when he followed him, the sea again came back to normal, and the Pharaoh had drowned. But when he went to Saudi Arabia, there he learned that the Muslims told him, that the Quran already mentions in Surah Yunus, chapter number 10, verse number 92, that Allah says, we shall save the body of the Pharaoh as a sign for posterity. Dr. Morris Bukail, he was shocked that how does this book, the glorious Quran, 1400 years back says that Almighty God will save the body of Pharaoh as a sign for posterity as a sign for humankind. And this is not mentioned in the Bible. So that instigated him to read the translation of the Quran. And after he read the translation of the Quran, he was so much inspired that he wanted to understand the Quran better. So at the age of 50, he learned Arabic as a language to understand the Quran better. Imagine a non-Muslim, a Christian. To understand the Quran better, he learns Arabic as a language. And after he does research, he says that the scientific points mentioned in the Quran are in perfect conformity with what modern science has discovered. And unfortunately, there are many things in the Bible which do not conform with modern science. And after doing further research, he writes a book, The Bible, the Quran and Science, which became very famous. The point to be